pizza It's so delicious It's Vancouver Island's Pizza Reviews Hey everyone, it's Clint from Vancouver Island Pizza Reviews. We're here today at uh, Rusticana uh, Coffee Shop. They've got all sorts of uh, baked goods. They make pizza. Uh, I came here last weekend when we did the mill pizza um, in the Thrifty Foods Plaza there. So they're just like right across the street next to Island Savings and like the co-op. Uh, definitely come and check them out. Look at this. I know you guys are gonna see the photo on Instagram like the day before I post this, but this looks absolutely unbelievable. They have a little list of, um, they basically got a list of the types of pizzas they make. Uh, they don't have cheese on the menu, but Cindy was very, very nice and, and, and made me one. Uh, but they've got, you know, like Hawaiian and veggie and, and all those kinds of ones. So definitely come and check them out. Um, they've got regular crust. Uh, they've got the, the, sorry, they've got a, a rice crust, which is gluten-free, of course. They've also got the um, cauliflower crust, which is, what, which is what this is. It looks unbelievable. I am super, super excited. Okay, guys. Going to go in for a uh, taco grip. Super hot, just came out of the oven. Oof. Okay, I'm gonna grab this piece here. It's gonna have a really good flop on it because there's lots and lots of cheese and it's super, super hot. Remember, it's also a cau cauliflower crust, so, okay, you know what? Go for this big guy. I'm super excited about it. Just, just the look of this, I'm already thinking it's probably going to be a nine. <laughs> okay, taco grip. Boom, look at that. Unbelievable. Okay, taste test. That is unreal. Um... There's definitely a taste that r reminds me of something. Really good crust. Unbelievable sauce. The cheese is amazing. It's super like sharp and, and tasty. There's a lot of flavor. The crust is amazing. I can't wait for this crust bite. Um, by the way, there's gonna be a bonus review of their uh, croissant, which I did last weekend and the croissant is uh, very delectable. Um, I believe it's made from a patisserie in Victoria called, um, I'll have the name on the screen. Uh, I can't remember it right now, but this is fantastic, guys. Um, okay. It almost has like a... I'm trying to put my finger on the, on the, on the flavor that it's reminding me of. It's almost like a lasagna. Like, it's got a very, very nice cheesy, the tomato sauce. Very, very good taste. Okay, let's get a crust bite. Wow. Every bite gets better. I'm not going to lie, guys. I didn't expect this. Um, this is a coffee shop. I thought it was going to be good because everything in there is good, but this is one of the best pizzas I've had since I started doing this, for sure. Wow. Okay, rating time. It's going to be high. People are going to be mad, but... You got to give the uh, props when, when the props are due because this is just unreal. Um, and a lot of people who haven't tried cauliflower crust, this jacket might have been a little bit too much for today, so I think I'm sweating. Anyone who hasn't tried cauliflower crust, there's not like a particular taste to it. It's just very crunchy. As you can see, it browns really nice on the edge. I rec recommend getting it wherever you go. Even if you don't have a gluten sensitivity, Still get the cauliflower crust. It's it's that good. Just thinking about the score. 
Um, okay, guys, rating time. I'm going to rate this a 9.2 out of 10. Unbelievable. You have to come and try it. If you're in this area, especially triple smoke, come down here and try this because you are going to love it. Okay, guys, bonus review coming up. On to the next one. Vancouver Island Pizza Reviews. Uh, we got a little bonus review here, here today. Uh, so we stopped in at Rusticana uh, Coffee Shop, uh, 803 Mill Bay Road, just across the street from like the Thrifty Foods Plaza, which has the Mill Bay uh, Mill Pizza, which we're about to try. Um, so I came in here. Uh, I've frequented here quite a few times when I come up to Shawnigan. It's kind of a little staple place for me. I've got a lot of uh, nice outdoor seating, uh, really good coffee. Uh, they actually make pizza here too, which I just found out. The kitchen closes at 2, uh, and it's about 2.30 right now, so we're going to come back like next weekend and do it. Um, but I'm super excited because they, they do pizza. Um, so I just came and grabbed there. They've got like an almond croissant and a chocolate croissant. I grabbed their chocolate one because I just did an almond at uh, La Rue. Uh, so let's get a look at it here. It looks really, really nice. Might not be able to see it that well because it's in the box, but um, they also heated it up for me a bit, so it's a little bit melty. Okay, a uh, little taste test here. It's going to be super messy. I already know I'm going to love it. And just get ready because my face is going to get covered in stuff. Mm. That's unbelievable. Um, croissant scale it's also warmed up a little bit too right so it's kind of like comparing a cold pizza to a hot pizza it's a hot croissant so it's I would literally rate this like a 9.4 out of 10 Un unbelievable if you're in uh, Mill Bay Definitely come check these guys out. You'll find something you like. Okay, guys, on to the next one. Hey, everyone. Thanks for watching my review of Rusticana's Pizza and Almond Chocolate Croissant. Please subscribe on YouTube and make sure to hit that like button. Cheers.